Hey everybody, uh, it's Andy Carl again. Can't get enough of me on Broadway.com with the Oz blog. Uh, blogging for Broadway.com with the Oz blog. And uh, we're here with another week. This is my third week uh, at the show. And as you can tell, it's already taken its toll. Because I'm happier than I was before! Um, I'm having a great time at the show. Uh, and I also decided that every week I'm going to try to bring you, the viewer, a new song. Short songs, not incredibly long songs, but songs that are that are all dedicated to the Oz blog. I have some apple in my teeth. See all the interesting things you get to learn back here at the uh, at the Wicket. So let's get started with uh, new people, new faces, new songs. Uh, new Oz blog for this week and uh, next week uh, I have I've been writing songs so I've about I have three in the bank for later uh, and we'll do one every week and I'll try to do my best and entertain uh, and uh, and bring you the happiness of of wicked Oz blog yo what's up everybody it's the Oz blog and we are backstage we got Rebecca Grady here she's the walk-on for today and that means that she's going on stage uh, and she's not a part of the cast but today she will be as certain parts of the cast she'll go on stage and she'll walk on with us that's very exciting but uh, welcome thank you and Oz blog it up for Rebecca give me a little Oz blog pose as promised by me now betraying somebody else in a James Lipton-esque sort of way. Interviews with fellow cast members throughout this blog, or perhaps just this blog. Maybe later I won't do that, depending on how this goes. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce one of the finest actresses in all of time and space. Jenny Fellner. <laughs> you play Nessa Rose in this show, and that is a good thing. Mm -hmm. Jenny! Yes? Your parents came to the show recently. They did. And your boyfriend. Yes. I saw them coming backstage. Uh, I gave them a poster. Uh -huh. I hope they enjoyed that. They did enjoy that. I am a nice person. Yes. A, a class act is what. Thank you. Classy guy. Uh, did they enjoy the show? Had it been their first time to see it? It actually hadn't been their first time, although they came once before, right after it opened, and it was a Tuesday night, and they came at 8 o'clock instead of 7. Oh, that's the mistake. Ladies and gentlemen of Broadway.com who are watching, and all of you in the vast internet web that you weave, the shows on Tuesdays are at 7 o'clock. Come early. Earlier than that seven. American Idol thing. With the vote. <laughs> yes, <laughs> and we'll have some, probably the seven p.m. done right here right. by Broadway.com. Yes. Just fill that in, editors. Seven. Oh no, it's seven. S seven. Dot o o p m. <laughs> Tuesday. Let's let's talk about your other characters that you played. Mm -hmm. uh, Linda English, Hal Joey, uh, Nessa. You played Nessa Rose. Yes. Sir. That's on the list. Audrey from Little Shop of Horrors. Did I already ask you about the fact that you play a lot of downtrodden roles? Um, no, but that that is a. And are are you like that in real life? No, I'm not. I don't know what it, you I'm know. Just... I I love those parts. I'm just kind of unsure what it is that I emit, right? <laughs> Emote, emit. <clears throat> I walk in a room and it's just like, wow, that girl's pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> but they, you know, they brighten this room up. Just, they we, brighten this room up just to make you less. That's right. Than that. Cause man, yeah, I do. I get, I get a lot of tragic, which sad girls, fun. which is fun. Yeah, but it just kind of makes you wonder. Of course, me as Fiero just is a perfect fit perfect. because I'm just like so cool Hero. all the time, <laughs> never, never goofing off. No. Jenny, <clears throat> what do you eat in between shows? It's a Wednesday, by the way. It is a Wednesday. And we are in between shows. And I'm wasting your time with this oh, question. Oh, can I do this, maybe? That, a little bit that of cozy? Oh, that's enough? Sometimes. 
Oh, just that little. Just that. Just Diet Coke is really all I. Like. Cigarette and Diet <laughs> yes, Coke. Yes. Yes, we must maintain our figures <laughs> for Wicked. Um, I am a big fan of the cozy because you can get a little soup mm. and a huge bread thing. The bread bowl really soup, cheap. delicious. It's really cheap and tasty. There's a cozy on the corner. There's a cozy on the corner. So come early on Tuesdays, maybe a little bit earlier. Drop by Cozy's on the corner Catch it of Broadway and 50th, First. 51st. Mm -hmm. We're not really, I'm not saying that Cozy should, you know, sponsor us, but they can send over some free food in case we happen to mention them That's to right. thousands of people watching Broadway.com. Cozy's delicious. See, here's a really interesting thing as well. Yes. You, there's some things that you've spoken of that you are doing in your extracurricular activities outside of the show. Mm -hmm. uh, one of those is Taekwondo, the art, the martial art of Taekwondo. That's right. And that's pretty cool. It's very cool. I'm going to be... How far along are you? Um, it's been a couple weeks, two weeks or three weeks. Going into so pretty much like... Wicked really, really and Taekwondo are mm -hmm. synonymous. Yes. This was my year of doing things that I always talked about doing and never did. So that's one of them. Um, and it's a really different, it's like walking into a new, a completely yeah. different culture. And I can imagine. I mean, it's not really musical theater. No. But I love it because there are, there are goals with the belts, you know, like you're working towards something and it's really there's meditation involved and there's terminology to learn so it's um you're learning a lot as you're exercising so it's like girl scouts with karate <laughs> so, yes of which uh what can you show me well let's see here about what if i like attacked you and then you did something and you could show me what you did why don't oh. you choke me one hand both hands both hand choke both hand choke i'm coming in first thing i'm gonna do is Ugh. and then i'm gonna do this and then I'm going to do that, and then I'm going to go boom. Wow. <laughs> I'm scared. But when you do this last move, you're right. supposed to key up, which actually means ha. Oh, but nice. But what comes out of my mouth is sometimes poof, <laughs> which they, poof. they've tried to correct. You're kidding me. <laughs> no. Really? no. Poof. poof. I think this has been a, just a wonderful, wonderful interview, yes, Jenny Fellner. Thank you for taking the time. Please go eat your cozy <laughs> and make sure that you're here on time for Tuesday's performances. Yes. Jenny Fellner, Always. star of stage and screen and winner of my heart. <laughs>